hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel in today's video i have a collective haul if you're new to my channel welcome my name is carla and on this channel i share videos on fashion beauty and lifestyle if you enjoy these kinds of videos then please subscribe down below so like I just said in the intro, I do have a collective haul for you all. This is very, very chill, sit down. As you can see, I just have on my robe, um, very casual, but I wanted to share a couple of miscellaneous things that I picked up, but they're very helpful and very useful. Are they miscellaneous? Not really, but um, it's just like not a, a specific theme of things. It's like m different themes, um, a different category of things so that's why i wanted to make this collective haul so the first thing we're going to start off with are these glasses right here so these glasses are from z e e l o l i almost want to bring it over here there so that the print from my robe isn't messing with the print on here and i do have like a ring light around so it's gonna throw off how the glasses look because sometimes well usually I do get the ring right here but these glasses like they are for the people like myself who love something a little more bold um, something that stands out I'll show you guys them on this is how let's see I'm trying to get them without the ring like this is them on I really really like these like they're big um but these are the glasses and I really like them I feel like they're how stunning are these they're big so if you're not into big glasses then these glasses aren't really gonna be for you but I just love the statement and yes I have on this bowl printed robe so it almost takes away from the glasses and when I wear them it probably wouldn't be like a lot of prints so I feel like I won't have that much of an issue but yes I ended up getting a couple of pairs and I'll show you guys all of the pairs that I got I feel like I looked I look a little washed out in this camera but it's okay it's okay here is the next pair um, as you can see I went for bold pieces and that's just what I like I like bold pieces for those days where I'm not wearing too much but I want my glasses to stand out I've said this before on my channel I wear glasses all of the time it's my accessory and I just like to have fun with my accessories if I'm gonna have to wear something every single day I'm gonna have fun with it and that's how I feel about my glasses so yeah these are also from Z E E L O L and I'll have them linked down below but look how stunning do you guys see these like how stunning are these and I will say as far as fit goes I do feel like these in particular fit better than these like they're the same shape as you can see they're like the same shape but this one for some reason just fits a little lower it's not awful but these just feel like they fit better on my face and then I ended up getting this pair so this is definitely a more neutral pair they're just so stunning i really really like these like oh and i'm gonna show you them on oh do you guys like are you guys seeing this like look at that how stunning are these glasses like oh it's the browns do you guys see that like that nice beautiful rich brown and then you get that light brown and I just love how big they are they're a bold set of glasses and they just look so good like I really really like these of the of the three that I just shared these are definitely my favorite pair I think the runner-up yeah I think the runner-up would definitely be these ones because 
Do you see the detailing? I just love the details on these glasses. They're just so stunning. I really like these. Um, they're definitely the runner up. Those are the three pair of glasses that I got. Again, I got them from Z-E-E-L-O-L -E -E if you have not heard from them. I've seen them everywhere. Like I feel like it's a Instagram ad eyeglasses store. So I was like, let me just try them out. Um, I usually get glasses from anywhere that takes FSA because I use the FSA account. If you don't know what an FSA account is, it's an account where you put money away for like medical stuff if you pay for um, co-pays anywhere. Co-pays at your doctor's visit, co-pays if you go for like a chiropractor, anything that you have to pay co-pays for, they take, you put money in or they take it out of your check and it's actually something that helps as far as taxes go. When you go to file your taxes for the year, um, it helps with that. So yeah, usually I use my FSA account and that's where I buy my glasses from. However, Zilu, Zilo, I don't know how to pronounce it, um, they do not take the FSA account, which was kind of a con for me because I'm someone who's already putting away money for things like eyeglasses or anything that has to do with medical um, or eye or dental stuff. Um, that's just one of the cons for me. So on to the next. The next thing that I picked up was this roll on um kayali kayali um perfume you guys know i've been into fragrances i got on one end is the white flower 57 on the other end is the amber i've been trying to get um is it vanilla but they've just been all sold out like oh this smells so good i love the white flower it's definitely a more musky sense if you're into musky like florally musky it's definitely musky um and then the amber has a more let's see if it's musky as well no it's more of like a i feel like there's vanilla in this scent as well let me see and i ended up getting this one because that's all that was left and i wanted to try or see the Kayali scents. Oh, smells so good. So the Amber, Black Cherry, Tobacco, Amber, Vanilla. You can definitely smell the vanilla kind of scents in the Amber. It smells very, very good. Let's see. So another one of the items that I got was this new camera. Um, I honestly think I'm probably gonna end up doing a video separate just to give you guys like the review on this um, some of the extra accessories that I picked up for this camera this is let's see if it'll show you so this is the Canon mark 2 g7x I can tell you guys right now like I wish I had purchased this camera before I purchased the camera that I usually film on. So the camera that I usually film on is the Canon M50. Um, that's what I usually film on. And that was like a little bit of a learning curve for me, learning the settings and all that stuff. And I feel like I can still improve. And that's what we do in life, right? We continuously learn new things, which I'm okay with. But as far as starting out and just having something that's easier to use, this is it. Like the Canon G7X, the Mark II. Um, yeah, I'll probably do it, like I said, an entirely different video on solely this camera. Um, and how it's been for me thus far but yeah this is another one of my recent pick-me-ups the next fragrance that I picked up was the Lancome Adoli Idoli I think that's how you pronounce it this scent I don't know I'm not gonna return it but I can't say that I like really really love it for some reason it just smells I'm gonna try to put it somewhere where, like it's not awful, it just, so this is the scent, I don't know if you guys have ever watched any of my videos where I said like I had kind of like 
not PTSD, but the sense that I used to use when I was younger was a bit too much, too mature for me. And this almost brings me back to those days. It's definitely a more mature, like older um, kind of scent. And I just, I don't know, something about it. It just reminds me of the scents I used to use. It's not an awful scent. It's just that it brings me back to the scents that I used to use when I was younger. And it was just too mature for me. Um, I'm probably, maybe in like a couple more years, it would be a scent that would fit me better. But for right now, it's not a scent that I really like. It's not awful. It just throws me off because it just reminds me of back in the day when I was younger and I should not have been wearing those scents. Next, we have the Dior back face and body backstage um, foundation. The Dior backstage face and body foundation. So this foundation, I'm gonna be doing an entire separate video on as well. Um, I'm gonna be doing a separate video for the camera as well as this foundation because I want you guys to see how it looks on my face. I ended up getting it in the 6.5 six neutral and I also got it in the 6 neutral and I just wanna see like how it looks on my face, like which color is best for me. I've heard good things about this foundation so I expect good things from this foundation. I'm just gonna open it and show you guys what the bottle looks like. So this is what the bottle looks like like i said i got this in this is the six five neutral and i also got it in the six neutral i just need to try it out and see which one fits my face best so stick around for that video if you want to see more about this foundation so that was another recent pick me up another one i shared this in a vlog but i went back and i got more i cannot tell you guys if you have not tried the cream of nature so this is the cream of nature argan oil from morocco i don't think this is a new line to be honest i do not think this is a new line um i've seen it so much i've been buying it for a while now um i just keep stocking up keep stocking up and for some reason every time i go to walmart that's where i get this every time i go to walmart it's just so hard to get them so i just keep stocking up because i feel like this is a forever line for me because it works so good with my hair texture before i would comb my hair out and my hair would fall out and i just feel like it had to do with the shampoo and the conditioner or any of the items i was using before was almost stripping my hair but this line it just i don't know it just retains the moisture it keeps the strength of my hair it's just so good so i got the shampoo and the conditioner um I'm trying to get, they have, I just want everything from this line because it works very well on my hair. It's just like, it's just that, like I just said, every time I go to Walmart, they're pretty much out. Um, so I am working on that. Uh, that's pretty much everything that I picked up and I wanted to share with you guys. I probably will be doing more collective hauls because I pick up so many things and I like to share them in case you're just looking for new things. That's why I like these videos. I like collective hauls because it's just random things that's very helpful so i wanted to share a couple of the things that i got with you guys if you enjoyed this video if you have any questions let me know in the comment section down below remember to be kind to yourself and be kind to others love yourself and love others as well see you in the next video